this uh, simple introduction to the machine that I have just completed to give you a simple idea of how economical you can create a scroll saw. In this particular case, the scroll saw that I have created cost less than 20 US dollars. It could even be less if you didn't have to buy a motor as used in the sorry, in the washing machine. The advantage of this saw, which I think it might be the first one in the world, that it is very, very easy to replace the blight. The blight replacement is so simple, there is no others like this one. I only have to reduce the tension, bring the blight there, like that, and this is what you have. It's only, is able to cater for the thick blight, thin blight, or even for this kind of blight, they will all be able to fit. The wider is mine, it can engage into that. Now, to put the blight back, face down, very easily, just go in, with your having to look, with your having to waste time. Put tension on the blight. And it's operating. Just for this quick demonstration, I will try to cut half inch, half inch craft wood. No problem whatsoever. Penetrate cuts in very, very well. Craft wood by changing the blades uh, to this normal blade is the same operation. It fits exactly the same fitting, so there is no additional fitting. To remove the blade, just a simple, you only need two Allen keys in there, when the blade is there, two Allen keys, you replace the blade. Even in complete darkness, a person is able to take the blade out, here's the blade out, with the fitting and all that, just go inside, I don't even have to look underneath it where it is, which is a big plus when you compare to all others, that is virtually impossible to change the blade as you cannot see underneath it. This one here, put the tension back on, and the blight is replied. Check the tension in the same. Finish. The saw it's only got the motor 1440 RPM. Instead of that motor, you can easily use a, a DC motor and regulate the speed. I use this one because I had the motor available. The bench top that I have on this particular one is just craft wood. I can easily put laminated with a bit of aluminium, with contact glue, or a bit of laminex. Then in few years time, or months time, or whatever, I can just replace that, and uh, I got a new bench. So it's very simple. The total saw only weighs 10 kilo with the motor and everything. So it is very light, very compact, very easy, very simple. I, to achieve this point, I made three models before that. This one was the first one, the second one here, and this is the third one. I was not happy with them, and you can see hundreds of parts. I try all different systems. Try to get the idea, try to make it as simple as possible, and this is the result. I mean, it could not be made any simpler. 
Beside that, you can, by having a DC motor, you have variable speed, or you can just change the size of the pulley. That's all. That is a very simple saw, very economical, and that's all I can present. This is my first video. In the next few days, I'll be launching another video and giving more detail on the blind replacement because it's so simple and it's so aggravating with the whole system in changing the blight. Thank you very much for watching.